All right, Halos, welcome back. How's everyone doing? I believe previously we actually finished the main, uh, like, default difficulty, uh, every level on that, so we could go back and do some more of the default missions, like the bonus missions and stuff. Uh, that might be what we do today. Let me go ahead and find that 50 gem chest, though. It should be somewhere around here, though I'm not sure where exactly. Uh, but yeah, we opened up a bunch of stuff, we found a few extra things, and, uh, yeah, pretty much just finished most things that we needed to. Um, we found this little, like, church place down here, or whatever it's called, and a bunch of other stuff. But yeah, let's go ahead and find the 50 gem chest real fast. Let's see, is it up top, possibly? Otherwise, it could be hidden, actually, on the other side of the map down on the right. Let me check out real quick. Uh, check that out. Or maybe I got it in the last part. I, I can't remember, actually. I might have uh, already gotten it. Sometimes it does actually spawn over here, though. So let me just check real fast. Uh, there should be a secret way somewhere over here. Where is it? Uh, I think it's right here? Yeah, yeah, I just missed it a little bit. Alright, um, yeah, I'm not seeing it. I think we probably got it in the previous part, so I'm not going to worry about it. But yeah, we found that little place as well, so that's pretty cool. Either way, uh, let's find where we want to go next. So we have all these uh, other DLCs and stuff that we can get to. But uh, before we do that immediately, um, I think I want to go ahead and do some of the other stuff. So we have the daily trials, of course, that we could do. Um, Mob speed is increased by 50%, damage is increased by 50%, and then players have freezing enchantment equipped. Uh, this is the adventure mode one, though. Uh, if we went to the back of this one, rewards are lower, and uh, there's less good stuff, so we're just going to be doing adventure from here on out. Uh, but yeah, we could we could play through everything again if we wanted. Uh, we have the adventure hub, which is uh, kind of the season pass type of thing. Oop, I didn't mean to leave that sorry about that uh and then we also have a couple of these other ones that we have not checked out like the lower temple or the under hall so i think i might actually just do that let me check it says recommended power 51 and right now we're only 41 um yeah so i think i think we'll wait on that for a little bit we need a bit higher power uh power right now so let's do something that's more in all our ballparks this one's 39 and we can get 41 to 48 gear so that would be really good um this one's also 39 let's see what stuff so you have boots of sweatness you can get a couple of things we haven't discovered yet but this is some of the stuff that uh, are possible to drop in this uh so creeper woods i would like the death cat mushroom um I, I need i would like to have three of them if possible although there's other things that are better as well but i think that would be super useful and then um at least for my full build that i'm planning on doing hopefully if i can get the right gear um I'm not super worried about these, uh, but yeah, I think I think we'll go ahead and do some creeper woods once again. But this time it's in adventure mode, so let's check it out. <laughs> I think I have the robes on as well right now, so I probably don't have that extra defense that I was ha that I had before. I'm just gonna go ahead and skip that because we've already seen the little cutscene. It doesn't change. Um, but yeah, let's see, what do we have? We have our power arrow with piercing and ricochet still. This one, okay, we do have the power enchantment. We could do one more level up, which would actually be pretty nice. Should we do that? I think we might. Honestly, we have fire respect three on here. And then these are all maxed. So yeah, I think I will go ahead and upgrade it one more. Um, that'll be useful for sure. Uh, all right, let's continue on. Free the villager. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. It's fine though. All right, let me get back into the groove. It's been a quick minute since I played. Not super long, but definitely, definitely not like I was just playing the other day. Thing. Got that like kill thing. There we go. It's got some fire aspect that worked out there. I wonder if fire aspect uh, applies every single hit or if it's just. Uh, if they don't die. Yeah, it looks like it's just if they don't die. It'll apply. Oh, I didn't want to get hit there, but it's okay. Get plenty of XP from all these enemies too, which is nice. Oh yeah, we also have the, uh, I think, uh, what is it called? Some kind of burning enchantment. So if, if enemy gets to get near, they also burn from that as well. Which is pretty nice. If I do say so myself. Okay. 
Alright, nice. We got some arrows as well, which is useful. Um, make sure we get everything. Got some TNT. Let's go. Apple, that's really nice actually. I did take a little bit of damage and I wanted to uh, not, not take as much damage. There we go. Perfect. Alright, we can also check out the map and see 03 secrets found and 05 chests open. So we have 5 chests on the map total and then 3 secrets that we uh, could find. So let's try to let's try to aim for getting all of those secrets, especially um, the chests aren't the end of the world, but it would be good to get those as well. Imagine they like hit something behind the waterfalls or something here. That'd be funny. To my knowledge, they don't, but um, maybe they've updated it. You never know, right? <laughs> let's go ahead and toss that over there. That'll help clear out those guys a little bit. Save us a bit of time. Free that guy real quick. Find the caravan. Got you, buddy. Alright, it doesn't look like there's... Oh, there we go. I thought there was a little urn there, but I was like, wait a second, I can't see it. Alright. Oh, we got swiftness. That's nice. Definitely, definitely. Uh, yeah, this is the bonus area, if I'm not mistaken. So let's find this real quick. Let's go this direction and see what we can find. Should be some secrets in here somewhere. Yeah, it looks like if you hit the guy in the back, kind of, it'll hit the guy that's close as well since it's an AoE uh, weapon. It's pretty nice. You can kind of strategize a little bit around that. Oh, level up, let's go. Enchantment point earned. Sweet. Grab this. We have another chest here. I think that counts as a secret, right? It does. Okay. Okay. So hidden chest also counts as secrets. That's good to know. There's definitely. I think, if I remember correctly, there's a there's a few of those those guys. I know there's a ton on that uh, underground like redstone map. I think it is. A ton of those like hidden chests. If I remember correctly. Of course, there's a random chance for those to spawn, like, pretty much any time, um, but yeah. Alright, <clears throat> let's check this little corner real fast. It's an urn, but it doesn't seem to be anything else. That's quite alright. What else do we have here, by the way? Uh, I think we picked this up, right? It's a level 44 axe. It's better than what we have in terms of power level. It's not going to upgrade our power, though. I think I'll keep what I have right now, but um, it's definitely not bad. Exploding. Mob is glowed after they are defeated. Okay. Interesting. Alright, let's make sure we didn't miss anything over here. Let's go ahead and open this guy up real fast. Yeah, I think we're good. We already checked everything over here, right? Yep. Alright. Secrets found. Two of three. I think that's what this one counts as. So this counts as a secret. We've already got that location, but I'll go ahead and put it anyway. Plus, it opens up. Uh, or does it open up the next part of the map? I think it... I think it does. But we have to obviously do a little bit of uh, crowd control here, I guess. <laughs> there we go. Yep, that opens up the map over there. We've got a soul bow here. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see. I guess let's go down first real fast since that's where we're headed. We'll go up here in just a bit, but first let's go down. I'm trying to use this uh, strength while I can. There we go, cool. Alright, strength timed out, but that's fine. Oh. There's the exit, of course. Um, I guess I should have gone up, shouldn't I? That's fine, that's fine. I'm gonna toss this in there, see if I can get any of those guys. Got a few of them at least. I'll take it. Sword guys are tanky. Alright, got a chest here, that's nice. Another axe. And then how are we doing on secrets? Chest open two of six, two of three secrets found. So one more secret that we can find yet, and I think I 
feel like I might know which one it is, but we'll figure it out. Let me go ahead and finish this side of the map off. Get all the XP that we can, as well as, um, sorry, one sec. Okay, as well as, uh, just, like, any chance we might find some extra loot and stuff. It's always useful as well. I didn't really need to throw that TNT, but I wanted to. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Let's get out of here. That was the last of those fellas. Oh, I missed that. It should be this one, right? Yeah. Get a little confused sometimes, you know? Discombobulated, disoriented. I don't think you can go down here, right? I'm pretty sure that's just off the map. Yeah, it's off the map. I'm fairly certain. Sometimes you can actually kind of like go on the outskirts of the map, and sometimes there's even secrets there, but not super often or anything. This doesn't count as the other secret. Whoops. Okay. Alright, that was a lot of zombies on top of me. <laughs> to make sure we are good. Oh, we got a sword here. Okay. Alright, let's check out this area right here. Nothing hidden. Alright. <clears throat> Bundle. Let me go ahead and also check my inventory. Let's go ahead and see what we've got here. Soul bow, I really don't really care about, honestly. 45, 48. Wow, that's going to definitely level up our, our uh, you know, what's it called? What is this? Void strike. Attacking a target applies a damage multiplier that rises steadily to a max level, then is removed. Huh, that's interesting. Okay. Uh, exploding. Okay, yeah, got it. Um, I mean, it is a better level, and we'll get better power level stuff. So I think I'll go ahead and use it for now. Uh, I might switch back. We'll see. I've also got this axe, which does actually do a pretty decent amount of damage. See, so yeah, I'll go ahead and use this for a little while. See if it's if it's uh, good. All right, what have we got over here? Find the caravan is still the objective. Anything hidden over here? A little bit of gems. I'll definitely take the emeralds for sure. How many hits do we take to kill this guy? Two. Okay. Let's check in here. Is this a secret? No. At least not classified as one. Alright, there we go. Nice. Hunter's armor, more hunter's armor. Like I said, I don't really use the hunter's armor, but, um,. There's a chance it's worth you putting on. Yeah, it does like, raise our power level at least right now, which could be nice. Got deflect. Hmm. I don't know. I guess I'll use it for now, just for temporarily at least. Shadow form, but the armor is on top. It's kind of funny looking. Alright, let's do a little Zelda cosplay there and break a bunch of urns, <laughs> pottery, whatever, and then let's head back out, I'm assuming that did count, oh no, it added an extra chest, okay, so yeah, that, that's interesting as well, okay, it adds an extra chest, I didn't mean to click that, but it's fine, uh, is there any urn pots, like, down here, doesn't seem like it, yeah, the, uh, the Boots of Swiftness are also pretty nice, honestly. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, a little random spawn. Alright, well we got another Hunter's Armor, it was at 47. It's better than what I have. Just in terms of raw stats, so I'll go ahead and put it- Oh, it actually leveled up my, po my power as well, it's nice. That's good. Anytime your power levels up, that means you can be at better drops, so... Always useful. There we go. Some apples definitely help us out. 
What else do we have up here? There we go. This is the way it wants us to go, so let's check out the area down here first. I think that's the way it wants us to go, at least. I think it's supposed to go up there as well. Hold on, let me double check that there's nothing over here. Oh, no, there wasn't. Okay. Never mind. It wants us to go up and around and then across this bridge above us. I was mistaken. It doesn't want us to go up that direction yet. <laughs> oh, that's kind of cool. Is it worth doing this? No, it doesn't seem to be anything. Whoops. All right, well, we tried, right? <laughs> we tried. It was worth a shot, honestly. I wonder if there's anything in that little area there. Alright, let's take this guy out, this fella. And these. somewhat uh, stun the enemies when I'm hitting with the sword, so that's interesting. That's pretty useful. Didn't mean to press that, but it's alright. chest that's gonna pop out How about down here oh here's a chest nice little bit of emeralds definitely take those stockpile real fast <laughs> I've right, got a little supply chest here which is always nice let's head back out and head down Hello, sir. Come back here. Oh my gosh, you're really quick. There we go. We got him. Wolf armor, boots of swiftness. Ooh, let's go. Those are good level boots of swiftness, actually. Um. Oh, what is that? Lightning focus. Lightning damage deals increase. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, let's definitely put this on. How about that? Is that good? Uh. I do like that. What do I want to replace? I like my healing good buddy. Let's uh let's go ahead and replace the arrows, I think, for now. Seems like a good idea, right? That went on a long cooldown, that's interesting. Nice a little golden chest up here. Soul robe. Not exactly what we're looking for, but hey, this is something. Ooh, so this is super nice. Oh man, he got me. <laughs> okay, get this chest. Probably just emeralds, right? Uh, and the shadow brew. I'll take it. Sure. Oh, we got a rank up surprise. Goat? What the heck? Okay, interesting. Guess we'll check that out when we get back out of this map. Got some pillagers here. Ouch. Alright, that definitely hurt a lot. Couple of villagers here. Sorry, villager. 
helicopter finally. <laughs> Ouch! They still freaking hit me. Maybe I should grab some of these uh, animals first. There we go, nice. Nice, strength is actually really useful. the fence there? That's weird. Let's check that I didn't miss anything over here on the right as well. I think we're good, but hey, you never know. Oh, we got stuck on the fence. That was annoying. It's alright, though. Oh, yep, there we go. It's a little emerald pot there. Alright, let's continue on. Let us continue. Oh, that one does snowball. Snowball's super useful. Uh, little bonus area. So this is one of the other secret areas. Uh, you have to find a bunch of these actually and get these runes and this is how you open that thing in the uh, little temple thingy or whatever you want to call it. Nice, there we go. Got it. Good stuff. <laughs> Spooky. Like that was all the villagers that we needed to get, so there we go. Let's head up here, finish these guys off real fast. Grab the supply chest and then be on our merry way. On our merry way. Three chests, uh, I mean, secrets found. Oh, I didn't need to press that, whoops. Uh, and then seven of seven chests found as well, so nice. Should be pretty good here. All we gotta do now is just pretty much just finish the map, I think. Oh, nothing over there, alright. Should be pretty close to the end here, I think. for sure. Ouch. 
think this is the last of them. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright, let's get out of here. Victory! The are free from the clasp of the <laughs> yes, they are. To you. You're welcome, you're welcome. Traveling to pan camp. Oh, I missed, I missed like one mob or something there. <laughs> Got all the chests, a lot of damage dealt, some damage taken. Let's check out what we get for our artifacts. Death cap mushroom, nice. That's awesome, that's what I wanted. Okay, so um, actually with this bow, so far I think it might actually be better to use to not have the fire arrow. Uh, so we'll, we'll rock, rock with that for a bit. Does this raise our power level? It does raise our power level. Sorry, raise our power level a little bit, actually. Uh, okay. And other than that, I think we are pretty good. Power level 45 now. That's, oh, that's awesome. Uh, Death Cap Mushroom. Yeah, that's super nice. Uh, our Venture Hub. We did actually get something. Surprise Goat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> kind of weird looking, but... Yeah, we'll take it for sure. Uh, and then we should have our little chest somewhere around here. Let's see where it is. Not over there. Not up here. I'm stuck. There we go. How about down here? Don't see it over there. So it's possible that it is in this other section. Let's go ahead and check it real quick. It there. How about over here? Nope. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I'm not sure where the little bonus chest is then, because uh, usually it's one of these places, but evidently not. All right. Well, either way, thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and stop the episode here. Um, we'll catch you in the next part where we do some more uh, missions around and figure things out. So yeah, thanks for watching once again, and I'll catch you later. Peace.